goodness, this is money. Pure luxury, honey. Yes. Oh my goodness, Danny says. You and your husband should please let the poor breathe. Can you stop with the drama, Z, Oh no, please. what's the drama here? Stop. Hey, you said you were bored and voila! He's brought you in a luxury staycation. Mm. If it was my man, Eric, he would have probably been hanging out to one Ukwabi joint or something. And at the end of the day, we would split the bill. Okay, stop. That was funny. So you're laughing at my predicament, Abby? No, I'm not. It was just funny. You know, come on. Well, you know I can afford all of this even more. Have you forgotten the daughter of who I am? Girl, how can I forget? Oh. I know, I know, I know. But the flex is that you've got your own money. But your man doesn't let you spend a dime. I have you. Oh, ah! Stop with it. You envy. are blessed. And talking about my man, mm -hmm. why would Oliver bring me here for two days now and I've not seen him? And he promised to be here early today and he's still not here. Maybe he's busy now. Kind of busy. I'm not, gonna I'm not taking that. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, you'll be all right, last, last. Hello? Hello, my absolute love. What's good? Oh, babe, please. It's not fair, you promised. Oh, baby, baby, I'm, I'm so sorry, okay? Two hours. Just give me two hours, okay? What? Two more what? Look, babe, I am checking out of here if you're not here in the next ten minutes. I said I'm sorry. Okay, let's make it one hour, thirty minutes, I'll be there. Babe, I'm not listening to any of that. If you're not here, in the next 10 minutes, I'm checking out and I mean it. I said, I'm sorry, baby. All right, love you too. Boo boo. I love you too, my world. And thanks for understanding. Is there anything you would want me to get for you while coming back? Um, okay, I, I don't mind the roasted plantain with a smoked fish. Oh, okay. The type we bought when we went to Aja, right? Exactly that one. Same taste, babe. Okay, I'll see you. But wait, wait, if you can't get it, it's not a problem. Just bring yourself over here. I want to see you, okay? Sure, boo. Okay, babe, see you. Bye. Look at you. Hey! Kodo Binigwe! Why must my own be different? Why? Look, oh, no, 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 no. God has blessed you with a caring, generous man. Yeah, oh, no, 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 God, God bless him for me. What? Well, Eric is not doing badly, and you know that. Well, he could be doing better. Come I mean, on, you're just greedy, girl. Girl, Oliver Twist has got nothing in my hand. Okay. <laughs> obviously, <laughs> obviously. But Eric, it's, he's, he's doing real good, so. He's trying, but yes. we want all of this, okay? We want all of this. <laughs> and we want all of it already. <sighs> just girl. like one more. Because you're Oliver Twist. I, am, I agree. <laughs> Well, let's cheers to what we're we trying to do. You've been extra. Ex oh, yes, I'm extra. More. I'm extra. Honey. Okay. <laughs> and we're cheers into more money. Okay. Because I need all of this all as of well. It. I need yes. more. And more. Okay. <laughs> Love you, girl. Love you too. Cheers. <laughs> cheers. Oh, my God. <laughs> Welcome, sir. Welcome, sir. Yes. Uh-huh. Yes, I just got here. I'm about to see. Welcome, sir. I'm about to see the wonders that you've done. Yes, I'm highly expectant. So I'm opening the door, ta-da. Oh wow, this is nice. Oh wow. This is nice. I'm glad you like the decor, sir. We aim to please. You know, the reason I decided to refurbish this place was because my wife got tired and bored of the old one. This is beautiful. I hope she likes it. I mean. Anything to make my queen happy. Oh, that's so romantic. I'm sure she'd like the change. I love the chandelier. It's beautiful. Wow, good job. I'll probably take a tour of the entire place. I just got to the living room there. Yes. 
Hold on, hold on, hold on for me one second. Hi. Good day, sir. Good day. Are you the aide from the agency? Yes, sir. Okay. Have they told you? Everything. Everything? Yes, sir. Good. Because the former maid was very timid and clueless. The main reason why you are here is for my wife's happiness. Yes. Anything for my queen. Okay. Do you understand? Yes, sir. That's your madam. If you displease her, you'll be fired immediately. I promise I won't. Good. Thank you, sir. So, um, I'm going to take a tour of the, the entire house. I'm heading upstairs right now. Baby, you yeah. done. Sorry, okay. Babe. Look, I'm, I'm so sorry. Baby, always do this. You keep me waiting. Baby, you know, all I'm trying to do is to, to build our world, to build our future. That's why I'm out there. I'm sorry, okay. Well, babe, you know if you decide not to work today, I can take care of us till whenever. You know that. I know and that. I deeply appreciate that, but um, what kind of man will I be? You know, a man that will have to depend on his wife and, you know, stress his wife for survival. A man is supposed to take care of his home. That's the kind of man I want to be. <laughs> and that's why I love you. Mm. The push, the drive to be the man. I love that about you. Thank you. Where's going to express what you mean to me? I may not have the entire world to give to you, but whatever I'll do to make you happy and comfortable in this world, I will do. Okay? Love you. Love you too. Mm -hmm. Okay, so your plantain is downstairs. Really? Yes. Oh. oh before you get excited. Okay. I'm going to go in there and I'm going to freshen up. Mm hmm. And then I'm gonna come back to you. Okay. <laughs> then. Then what? You wanna join me freshen up? Yeah, babe, I'm be fast about it. Hurry up. <laughs> Don't keep me waiting. Go away, baby. <laughs> oh, babe! I know you did that on purpose. Baby, can you please help me with the towel? Yeah, sure. You were bored and tired of the old decor, so I did a bit of refurbishing. You like it? Okay, so because I said I was tired and bored with the old decor, you had to do all of this? Yes, baby. 
and you changed the entire place. You are helping me. What? Anything for my queen. You like it? Of course. I love it, babe. Come here, naughty boy. Mm -hmm. You know what? Let's go check out the rest of the rooms. Okay. Maybe it's nice. And I get some more kisses. I'll give you truckloads of kisses. Yeah, baby. Let's go. <laughs> hey, baby. Beautiful, right? I love it. Sure. Oh, baby, why are you so sweet? So you can pour the sugar then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's something small. It's something but very small. Downstairs. Oh my God, babe. Oh my God. <laughs> what did you do? I can barely recognize this place. Really? Yeah. Babe, hey, why are you this sweet? Do you like it? Of course, yes, babe. I like it. You've melted my heart with so much love, babe. Do I really deserve this from you? Shouldn't that be my lie? You loved me, and nobody liked me. You picked me up and showed me love. How can I ever repay you? Babe, you've done more than enough already. It's not. You're doing too much. Oops. It's like uh, my phone call. My phone too. Oh. It's calling me. Oh. Yeah, hello? Oh, you here? Uh, I'll be down in a minute. Hello? Hello? Danissa, where are you? Listen, what is going on here? Everywhere looks so. Oh, no, 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 no. You need to come downstairs. What? You're downstairs? <laughs> You're such a pest. This is because, 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 don't insult me. Eh? Wait, come first. This place, am I in the wrong address? Because everywhere looks so different. The sitting room, the kitchen. Listen, hurry downstairs, Biko. Hi. <laughs> Alright, I'll be coming right down. Xenia and her drama. She's around. Yeah, she's downstairs. Hey. Come on, give me a hand. I've got a surprise for you. Hey, come on. What are you up to this time? Come on, you find out. Let's go downstairs. Oh my God, babe. I, am I ready for this? You're ready for that. <laughs> Isn't oh, this too just, much? Just follow me. Hey. Too okay, my heart is beating this no, no, time. No. Are you sure I can take yes, all of this? <laughs> okay. Hey, hey. Honey. How are you, my love? Mwah. How are you? You look I'm so beautiful. Well, thank you. I do too. Oh my goodness. Hi, Welcome, Jenny. How, how are you doing? doing? I'm oh, Welcome. A man that knows how to please his woman. We just went on a vacation just because she was born. And next thing, we're coming back to all of this. What a total transformation. Anything for my baby? Babe, you're so sweet. <laughs> Danisa, I think which Baba do this juju for you? The juju strong, Hey, silly. <laughs> well, if it's juju, I definitely don't want to be saved, babe. Okay. Oh, babe, come here. Hey, <laughs> love is sweeter. <laughs> when money enter, love is sweeter. Oh, and I know so that I'm Hey, hey, Zinni, please. Yeah. Please, don't spill it, okay? Don't ruin the fun. Okay, what what is this about? Baby, uh -huh. you find out soon, okay? Okay, Zini, you're not saying. <laughs> Someone should say something. Yeah, I'm still you, you, find, you find out very That's not fair. Zini, even you. <laughs> okay, this is not funny. Oh huh? <laughs> okay, okay. Take it easy, take it easy. <laughs> take it easy, baby. Oh my goodness. Take it easy. Thank <laughs> Ta da! Oh my god, babe! It's yours. Ah. Go check it out. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, I love it! Babe! Can I have it? Open the cup, open the cup. Hey, babe! Babe, what is this? Why are you doing this? You deserve more than this, babe. Ah. Check it out. 
check out the interior of it. You have to spoil me. Baby, baby, you deserve more than this, okay? This is nothing. Check it out. You like it? You like it? I love it. I like it. Oh, she would nice. like it. I thought you should like it. Like it. I know, you said it. I think this is yours. Babe, why do you spell me like that? Baby. <laughs> you deserve, deserve more than this, baby. But Oliver, come on. It's like this my friend used to do hold you. He better come. Let me help you. There's one white common church around the corner. Yeah. Deliver me from her spell. I don't want you. This is good. Babe, you're an angel in human form. Oh. Done without you. I love you. Just flatter me, baby. Flatter me. That's these are the gates. What do you do for me, babe? Come on. Okay. Babe, keep it coming. Keep it coming. I love my car. Babe, this, how do you know this? I love this. I love everything about this car. My You're welcome. Car. You're welcome. On your back. Oh, Are you hungry? Babe, get us up. Okay, let me just back. put this. You don't want that thing you usually crave? <laughs> Anything at all? No. Are you sure? Yes. Do you want Chinese? Chinese. <laughs> I'm fine. You sure? <laughs> yes, I'm fine. Can we get you some whiskey? <laughs> whiskey. <laughs> I'm fine. Don't oh, worry. God. He's doing so well. Oh, nice. I can see. He's so playful like his father. I'm mm -hmm. going to carry him. <laughs> And, um, I usually get this, um, hot bun. Hot bun? Are you... <laughs> Don't worry, it's Tell nothing. Me. Yes. Are you sure? I think it just means that the child is a hairy child. Oh, then that's me. No, 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 you? babe. Mm -mm, no, if it's hairy, leave it to my family. Everyone in my family is hairy. Yeah. Everyone in my house, Maybe very hairy. Not it's true. It's good. It's 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 all right. It's okay. after me. Let's it's go. Your, it's your, it's your. Oh yeah. Goodness. You put a hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I also think he likes music. Oh, really? that, that's me. Yes. You too. Yeah. Okay, yeah, babe. I give you that. That's true. And I'm sure he'll be a very bad dancer like his father. I would dance to the radio. Because, <laughs> <laughs> you know, whenever I I am listening to a very good music, I could literally feel his excitement. You oh, choke music or ah, Good music. Good music. Nice. <laughs> You're doing so well. Thank, Thank you very you so much. much. And say, if you need anything, don't hesitate to let me know. Anything at all, okay? Let us know, okay? That's fine, sure. Please, yeah. I want you to be perfectly and absolutely well taken care of. I don't want you to lack anything, you and my baby. Looks like this is now. Sure, I will. Please and do. Thank you so much. Thank you. I really appreciate you both. Sure, you don't want anything? Thanks to you. No, I don't. Oh. Okay. Um, Give you some whiskey. I'm going to take my leave now. Oh, that was so fast. I have to. I'm, I'm going to see you so we can talk now about my oh, baby. Oh, baby, baby. Just relax, okay? Oh. We'll just go here. You're in high heels. Hey. Relax, okay? Catch up with Zinia. I'll see you. All right, it's fine. And you take care of yourself and my baby. I will. Say careful. Careful. Okay. Oh. Oh. Right. Here you go. Easy. <laughs> Please take care oh, of her. Sure, sure, sure. She's safe. Bye. I'll be, I'll be right back. Bye, Rose. Baby, give the baby a kiss for me. Oh, yes, <laughs> Oh my god, I can't wait to meet my babies. <laughs> what? I don't understand. What? What is happening? I, I, you let this happen. No, 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 no. You shouldn't have agreed to this. This is just absolutely ridiculous. City, it's not like I agreed in the first place. I didn't. Well, you know, Oliver, he can be very, very persuasive. How can a man just decide for you not to carry your own child? Or is your own perforated? Zini. Don't be rude. Mm. I'm not being rude. I'm not being rude. It's just that that your man is doing too damn much. Even as a husband? Yes. <sighs> it's look. The thing is, he has this fear for childbirth. He lost his mom during childbirth. Mm. So he's he's so scared. Moreover, he said he doesn't want me to lose my shape. Mm. So what can a wife do if not what the husband wants? Oh please. 
isn't that the pride and joy of motherhood carrying your own child? Eh? You see why I didn't want to tell you this in the first place? Because I know you'd never agree of to it. Of course I wouldn't. Eh? The man does too much. And he's beginning to scare me. Oh. Anyways, last last, you go do all right. Mm, mm -hmm. That's my life. And I stole it. <laughs> <laughs> what are friends for if not to steal each other's well, punchlines? Food has been on the dining for the past three hours now. Should I take it out? Have you ever seen me eat without my wife? No, sir. So why are you asking me silly questions? I'm sorry, sir. Take the food away. When my wife comes, be ready to serve. Noted, sir. Hello, babes. Uh, what's going on? It's um, 11.45 p.m. And you're still at home. I've been stuck here in traffic for hours. It's really bad. Traffic? Oh. How, how bad is the traffic situation? Is it moving? It's just so slow. Oh, sorry, baby. Sorry. So wh where exactly are you now? Where are you? I'm at the express just before the road leading to 5th Avenue. Okay, so let me call you back. Let me see what I can do. I'll call you back. Okay? Just step with baby. Call you back. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, hello, Toby. How you doing? Good. Are you are you on duty tonight? Great, great, great. Okay, so I'm going to send you a tip of five hundred thousand now. Okay, I want you to do a favor for me. My wife is stuck in traffic um, on the road leading to Fort Avenue. Yes. Yes. So I will need you to help her navigate through the traffic, please. Thank you. Thank you. So um, do what to send me your bank details. All right then, thank you very much, appreciate it. Uh. Oh. Yeah, hello babes. Yes, babe. Um, I've sent someone to help you navigate through the terrible traffic. Policemen? Yes, my love, I can't afford to have you get stuck in traffic. Oh, come on, babe. You don't have to. No, no, baby. It's okay. As soon as it gets to you, we just hurry up and come home. Thanks, my love. It's okay. It's okay. I'll be home soon. I can't wait to see you. I know. I'm, I'm very hungry, baby. And you know, I can't eat without you. So, please. No, no, no. I'll wait for you. The food did not go the right way without you. You know, I can't eat alone. Sure, baby. All right. Get home safe, okay? All right. Love you. Bye. Hey. Babe. Mm -hmm. If you see the way traffic just cleared, immediately the police people got there. Like in a minute, everybody was staring at me. I was feeling like I was the president's wife. 
Thank you so much, my king. I mean, how did you even do that? Hmm? Anything to put a smile on your face, my love. Thank you, my king. I mean, thank you. I, I didn't believe it. Like, everybody was looking at me and staring at me. I'm like, yeah, that's me. Of course, that's you. See, um, I'm only doing my duty as a husband. Be my wife. Mm. Babe, you do too much for me. I don't know what I've done to deserve the kind of love you show me. You treat me with so much respect, so much regards. You pamper me like I'm an egg. Because you deserve it. Uh, babe, you treat me like I'm a queen. All of it. Like I'm, I'm speechless. I'm short of words. Thank you, babe. You're welcome. A queen you are, okay? Now, let's toast to my beautiful wife. Okay. <laughs> to my beautiful wife. Cheers, babe. Okay, my turn now. I'll feed you. Oh. And you can't say no. You have to eat everything. You have to finish everything. Okay, so let's have an understanding. Mm -hmm. You're going to feed me. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, I will. You feed me. <laughs> yes, babe, I will. Okay. okay. You feed me real good. I will. <laughs> All of it. Mm. There you go. <laughs> No, this is going to the right place. <laughs> you see why I can't do without you? I see. You make it fun. Ah, oh, babe. Well, Corey, I couldn't believe, like, I mean, me. Today, I felt like, is this what it means to be the president's wife? Maybe you're more than the president's wife. <laughs> you know what we're going to do? Well, next time, I'm going to. Invite or call in for a private jet. Oh, babe, I know you. Whenever you're stuck that. in traffic, private jet. Oh, babe, stop. I know no, you, no, no. you're crazy like that. You no, can't do that. Yeah. I was joking. No, you don't no, have baby, to. Baby, let's do more. <laughs> let's do more adventures. Babe, you don't have to. I know you're crazy like that. You yeah. could so do that. So the next one is going to be a private jet. Babe. Yeah, babe. I want to see you fly in the skies and as soon as you land at the airport, there's only like, the scale. You know? You deserve more than that. I love you so much, babe. And I love the way you love me. <laughs> now, you be smart. I never said I love you. You yeah. just did. You said you love the way I love you. Yeah, babe, come on now. You Okay, well, say it. Say it. I'm hearing. I'm listening. I love you too. Oh, <laughs> Babe, you're making me blush. <laughs> you need a fan? Actually, no. I <laughs> Oh, babe, stop. <laughs> you stop this thing, babe. 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 You stop this stop, please. <laughs> Hello, my love. Oh, um, I'm on my way to the office. I have a seminar in 30, okay? Why are you? I'm just parked by the roadside. I was driving and the car started jerking. I pulled over to see why, but now I've been trying to start it. It's, it's not starting at all. What? What's wrong with the car? I don't know. Oh, baby, I'm so sorry. I'm so, so sorry. A car I bought just six days ago. But why would Nelson sell me a faulty car? Why would he do that? Why? Baby, I'm so sorry. I can't afford to have you standing by the roadside. Please, is there a police barrier around you or maybe a police station where you can go for safety? You leave the car. Send me your life location, please. Okay, I'll send you my life location, babe. I'll just wait. Okay. Baby, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm really sorry. I'll see you soon. Why would Nelson do this? Why would Nelson sell me a car that has a problem? What kind of... Nelson, I'll deal with you. I'll deal with you for messing with my wife. How can my wife be stranded by the roadside? It...
Baby. 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 Look, I'm, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Um, what's wrong with the car? I don't know. It just won't start. Okay, let me just pop the bonnet and see what's going on. Baby, I think uh, I think it's a kickstart. Um, I'm so sorry. I'll just call the mechanic to come fix it. Oh, um, I'll just get a taxi. I'm almost late for my meeting. No, you don't have to use a taxi. Use my car. Hey, run along. So how are you going to cope if the mechanic needs to take the car? Don't worry about me. I'll probably uh, use an Uber, pick a taxi. Are you sure? Baby, I can't have a car and my wife pick a taxi. No. I could just pick a taxi. No, 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 baby. Come, come run along. Come. Use my car. Thank you, babe. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. There you go. Thank Run you. Run along, baby. Love you. Love you too. Take care. Yes. <coughs> yeah, hello. So, um... My car has broken down somewhere around the 16th Avenue. Yes, 16th Avenue, yeah, just around that side. Can you please come and check if you can help me fix it? Hmm? Please, I'm waiting, huh? Hurry up, hurry up, I'm waiting. All right, bye. Uh huh. What's the problem? The car won't start. I'm, I'm suspecting it's the kickstart. Please. Let me take it. Check it out for me. Sir, this is your kickstarter is bad. I even the engine is weak. How? I bought this car six days ago. Oh, Nelson. Okay. How much will it take to fix it? It will take you like 20,000 naira to fix no it. No problem, no problem. Go ahead and fix it. I, I'll transfer some money to you, okay? Okay. Um, are you free? Yes, yes. Okay. So, chairman, okay. fix it and bring it to me. Eh? I'm transferring the money to you. Nelson, Nelson, this, this behavior is unacceptable. You are getting me angry. Why do you sell me a bad car? Bros, you know this is an automobile we're talking about. And most times all these cars are unpredictable. Uh -uh. For a car that is barely one week old, did you sell a Nigerian used car to my husband? How could I? Madam, please, don't say that about my company. How many days have you driven this car? How am I supposed to be held liable for the car? No, sir. That is very bad customer service. Very bad one. So you're telling me your company does not give their customers the right to a warranty? Yes, they can. But just in the case of bad driving. Can I attest your driving skills? Eh? Can I? Eh? Probably went to go and patch the car saw me and you're blaming me for a fault that is not my fault. My friend, go and sit down. Ah, no, sir. Why did you stand up? Are you insulting my wife? She took the first point. Then you took your wife in the leash. Hey! 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 Get up, you fine. Get up, you think you're a big boy. Get up and face me. Nonsense. Hey. He's not moving. Oh, he's just, he's rested. It was just a job. It's nothing to take him out. And he's not moving. He, he seems unconscious. This is serious. 
Victor, what? Well, hey. See, you see, he's not moving. No, see, stop playing, stop playing, get up. He's dead. What do we do? Um, well, well, first of all, we need to send everybody out of this house immediately. Everybody in this house. Okay. That's what we need to do. Then... The body. Oh. Where do we take the body? Um... Oh, wait. Um, um, let me think. Um, I need you to go out now and buy me life chicken. Take, take. Ah, but, madam. Take. By this time? Yes, by this time. The people said it wasn't closed by now. I said I want life chicken and you must go and buy it. If you don't buy it, don't come back to this house. Like this? Yes. Like now, now? Yes. Well, go, go, go. And see, if you finish buying the life chicken, eh, you need to call me. There's something else I want to buy, but I can't remember the name. Now I'm still thinking of the name. So when you buy it, you call me and I'll tell you the name. By then, I would have remembered. Eh? Hurry up, hurry up. Yes, go, go. Give, give, give me the keys to the gate. Give me. Hurry up. Hurry up. Fast. Nkoyo. Mm -hmm. Please come. Um... In Koyo, there's, there, there's an emergency, so we... Yes, we're traveling. This night. Tonight. So we need you to leave immediately. Like, leave this house. Yes. Did I do anything wrong? Oh, no, 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 no. Not at all. We have to travel, travel. out of the country tonight. Baby, let's be here. Um, here. Here's your salary. But well, then, did I, did I do anything no. wrong? No, 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 no. We are going to United States of yeah. America, so. Don't worry, I can't call. wait. No, you no, don't no, have no. to. No, 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 we'll call you. Baby, we'll call you. Yeah, I'll call you as soon as we come back. We'll yes. be away for a very long time, Fine. so I'll call you. It's Please. not a problem. Hmm? Okay, ma. I think that's more than enough. Yeah. So get up and, and go, okay? Be you fast. Going, eh? Hurry up. We're also leaving tonight. Yes, as as after as you leave, leave, hurry up. We'll pack our things and go. Yeah. Safe okay. life. Stay here. Safe journey, Safety, too. too. Get your village people, eh? Hmm. <laughs> Hurry up, Hurry up. Quick, okay? Go!
This is all your fault. It's all your fault. What do you mean it's my fault? I was not going to sit back there and watch that guy insult you. But that fight was unnecessary. You should have just let it go. I just couldn't, baby. I couldn't watch him disrespect my wife. And you think this, this is the best way to sort this out? Now look at where it has landed us. Look at us. We're murderers. God. Oh. Uh, what? Look, it was an accident. I'm not, I'm not proud of what happened. But we'll come out of it. Baby, okay? how? You should have just let it go. Baby, it's too late now. It's too late. Come out of it. to leave. So where? Togo, Ghana, anywhere. And what makes you think I want to do that? What about my life here? What about my family? What about our baby? We're having a baby so so. How can I just get up and leave? Think. Think. We can always reach family. We need to get out of here, far away from the arms of the law. That's what I we need to do. I'm not going anywhere. You heard me. I am not going anywhere. You started this for so deal with it. You can leave if you want to. I'm not going anywhere. Please. Don't be going anywhere. Would you rather prefer you go to jail? Baby, what are you still doing there? Let's go already. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Um, let's go already. Uh, I'm coming, babe. I'm I, coming. It's... I was using the restroom. Using the restroom? Oh, stop. Oh, babe, I, I forgot to turn off the... Please, let's go. We have to go. Okay, come. Are you... Right, take the lead. Okay. Take the lead. No, no, I'll get the box. You just take the lead. Okay. okay. This place looks like a parking lot. Move your car! Are you insane? So sorry. Move your car! Forgive my manners. Well? Is that the best way to talk to someone who knows about what you did last night? What is wrong with this man? What are you talking about? What? Mm-hmm. 
I know you must have been highly entertained. <laughs> now, if you don't want that video to end up in the public domain by tomorrow morning, or better still, go viral on the internet. A paltry 10 million naira will save you that stress. What? You heard me clearly. 10 million naira in physical cash. Not in a hurry, my dear. We don't have time for sentiment. You've stated your case. Please be gone. Are you throwing me out? Well, as an aside, you have a very beautiful woman. You know, you're a very greedy man. Extremely greedy. But I like you. You have eyes for very beautiful things. But that doesn't mean that I'm envious. You asked me to leave. But I want her. You will not. I hate when spineless individuals like you make empty threats. It's my fault I did not introduce myself to you. And for information, I am Inspector Shola Ogunabale. And my men are standing by. I don't like violence. I'm a man of peace. So, be a good boy. Two days. Two days! And your ass will be outside. Now, let me tell you this. Make sure you don't allow anyone into this compound. Do you understand? Do you understand, stupid boy? I didn't ask for this. I'm confused. How did he get the video? I don't know. Wait. Who call you? Who call you? The video was taken from the corridor in this house. Anukoyo was the only person in this house that day. It's Anukoyo! Oh my god, it's her! Oh shit. Oh shit. Why would 
would she do that to us? It's her. Do it. Never. Over my dead body. Oh, babe, no, babe. No, babe, no! You will not sleep with that man! No! Are you not scared? He's got evidence. He's got the video. I don't care. Hey! Look. Ah! I turn myself in. You will do such thing. You'll go to jail if you do that. I don't care. And where do you think you're going? The police station. Baby, please. Baby, please, 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 Listen to me, look at me. You can't turn yourself in. If you do, they will lock you up and you'll go to jail. Please. How do I cope with that? We have a baby coming soon. I can't do all that by myself. I need you by my side, please. Okay. You've done everything within your power to make me happy all these years. Allow me to do this. Allow me to do this for us. Let me do this for you, babe. I'm the man of this house. If there's ever someone to make a sacrifice in this house, it is me. Babe, please. I don't want to lose you forever. Allow me to do this. Please don't turn yourself in. Please, I don't want to lose you. Stop. Get Please. Up. Get up. Get up. It's okay. It's okay. Hello, Mrs. Ofoka. I'm Inspector Shalau Bunabali, for CID. I'm here to see your husband. I know you. We've not met before. This is an official visit. So how can I be of help? Officer. Mr. Oliver, a certain Mr. Nelson was reported to have gone missing by his family. Police investigation suggests he was here on the day he went missing. So, was he here?
while he was here, we, we spoke about business. I told him I wanted to buy more cars, then he left. Really? Mr. Oliver, are you telling me the truth? Sir. Yeah. There are security cameras in this house, and I would like to have a look at the footage. Be my guess. Unfortunately, the, the cameras are bad. But I can let you see them. Sure. 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 Baby, could you please excuse us? Oliver, what makes you think that I was bluffing when I told you you have two days? Let me make something very clear to you, officer. You will not sleep with my wife. Really? With my lips. You will not. If you want extra money, I can gladly pay you. Let's say 20 million, 30 million, just name your price. It's not about running out figures, okay? I already told you what I want. There's no need being unnecessarily obstinate here. Be a gentleman, Oliver. It is. I'm not as greedy and stingy as you are. I mean, I can share. All I'm asking for is that you allow me to have a taste of that beautiful party. Why are you so keen on sleeping with my wife? Let me quickly remind you, you have just two days. Two days to do as I say. Else, we will be having this conversation in a dingy police cell. Do not bother trying to run away, because you cannot. What if we try? You think I'm kidding? To you, it's about, you know, questioning. As far as I'm concerned, you're a culprit. A culprit in a murder crime standing right in front of me. For your information, your names have been flagged up in the immigration portal as murder suspects. And any attempt to run away will be detrimental. Oliver. You know what? A little bird whispered into my ears that you are addicted to your wife. That you can't even eat without her. I have a confession to make. She's growing on me. I hardly sleep these days. I think I'm in love. Is this clenched fist for me? Give me a handshake. <laughs> the cameras are bad. Huh? The cameras are bad.
I said you will not sleep with Shala. So do you have a better idea? I don't. But I still maintain you will not sleep with Shalom. So what about me? What happens to me and our unborn baby? What if you'll be fine? We won't be fine, babe. We can't be fine. We can't be fine. You're my husband. I can't risk you going to prison because of mere sex. Mere sex? Did you call it mere sex? I can't have another man kissing you, touching you, being inside of you. You are my wife, my life. I can't do this, no. Hey, hey please. I can't. Do this for us, for me, for our unborn child. Please. What do I tell him when he grows up? What do I tell him happened to his father that his father went to prison because he killed a man? People, we can avert this in just one night, okay? Don't say that. Look at me. How did we get here? I can't believe this. No. <laughs> just let me fix this, okay? I can't bring yeah. myself to oh, yeah. it. Okay, let me. Let me fix this. Let me have the key. Let me have the key, please. The video. What about that? We had an agreement. 
I didn't tell you I was going to delete it after just one round of sex, did I? I don't understand. You don't understand? <laughs> what I'm trying to say is that I will not take up the matter with the authorities. That's a promise. But as for the video, I will keep it. And you, my beautiful darling, will graciously give it to me at least twice every week. That wasn't the agreement. Absolutely. But I didn't tell you how many times I was going to mow your lawn. Huh? And even if I did, I'm not going to keep to my word because you're too sweet. You're very disgusting. You're sick. <laughs> Nelson. My chairman. How's it going? I'm doing good. <laughs> so, what's next? What's next? Well, we are sticking to the original plan. <laughs> I'm enjoying this already. I don't think so. Actually, I am. I am enjoying it more. <laughs> Lady is too sweet. I bet she is. She doesn't know what's coming for her. Not an inkling. Oh. Nice book, huh? Yeah. I'm almost done. Well, um, my chairman, I have to be on my way. Okay, um, I'll catch you later. Okay. Could feel very terrible. I can imagine what you're going through. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry, baby. I'm sorry for what you do. Don't touch. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Don't you care about me? I feel miserable right now. Maybe I should have just ignored his utterances. And I'm so sorry for, for everything. I, I just let my anger go a better part of me. I'm sorry for this episode of trauma and shame I've put you through. I'm, I'm so sorry. At least you won't go to jail. 
Isn't this worse than going to jail? Hmm? I feel so terrible right now. Every strand of my masculinity has been stripped off me. Me knowing and bearing the torture and shame of another man sleeping with my wife. Just to avoid me going to jail for murder. It was worth it. No, it's not worth it, baby. It's not. <laughs> what do you want again? Why are you calling? Haven't you gotten what you wanted? Will you listen to me and stop ranting? What is wrong with you? Listen, if I were in your shoes, God forbid, I would be grateful. I will be happy for not ending up in jail. Inspector Shala, you can go rot in hell. You are the murderer who is going to rot in hell. Well, I called to find out if our woman arrived safely. You know, both of us own her now. Our woman? Are you mad? What is the meaning of that nonsense? The meaning? <laughs> she didn't tell you? Okay, here's the deal. I will keep your secret permanently sealed and in return, I will need bed services twice a week. How about that? You did, Chris. What in the walk you? I bet you won't die. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> You're threatening me, Oliver. You want to kill me the way you killed Nelson? You also be worse. Trust me, Shola. If I ever see you come close to my wife, I will kill you. <laughs> Empty threats. Hmm? Find out from her. I gave it to her the way you never did. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You said you will not be following me to the UK for the delivery anymore. Yes, I won't. Something came up. An emergency. But don't worry. Everything you need to be taken care of has been arranged. You're in safe hands. I would have really loved it if you came with me, though. I know. But like I said, you have nothing to worry about. You and my baby will be well taken care of. Please, do you have some clay cake? Pregnancy cravings? No. <laughs> yes. No, I don't. I could send Ibrahim to go get you some. Don't worry. I think I should have some here. Don't. I really. 
Sure, so we can add a white shop. Can't find it. We don't know. It's supposed to be here or yeah. here. Thank you very much. Thank you. Don't worry. I'll just go uh, tell you about what. Yeah. Okay. I'll, be, I'll just pack this through. Honestly, it looks really um, easy, okay? <laughs> okay. It's <getting> easy. <laughs> <sighs> well, such a nice time. Oh, honestly, would have been really, really nice if you stayed a bit longer. But then again, I'm not complaining. I'm just saying. I know, right? No. <laughs> you know where you're pregnant to have? Mm, I get it. I understand. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, I'll see you some other time, definitely. Yeah, bro, you should have just stayed back when food was almost ready. I know. Don't worry. I actually need to hurry back home because of the traffic. I know, I know how crazy it can be. And I don't want anything stressing you. Oh, my baby. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> and don't stress her, okay? <laughs> You're a good child. <laughs> sure. <laughs> All right, let me let you go. Ibrahim will help you with the gate. Okay, thank you. Please be safe. I'll just order it right. All right. Bye. Okay. She knows. Rose. What sort of nonsense is this? Do you know the implications of what you've done? I'm in the house. Calm down now. Damn!
ruined everything it did for years. Do you know what you've done? Guys, guys. What do we do? We need to act fast. What? I really don't think she saw the photo though. That is what I don't want to take. That chance. I need to call Shala. I need to hasten up that plan right now. Let's get the hell out of here, sis. Give me my passport. Yes, my passport! Sorry now, it was intentional. I beg you to stay one place. Talking about something serious. Look, nonsense this. Everything I've worked for. Mm. Hey, 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 don't talk to me that way. Cost this whole thing, you know. Get the focus out of now. All that. Just a simple task you cannot do. Who does that? I hope you've collected your passport from her. Because from what I'm seeing now, we're leaving this country on our own. I already have mine. But how do we leave this country now? How? Nelson is alive. What was I supposed to do? I thought my loving husband committed murder and I was trying to cover up for him. But we have found a way for you to cover up for him without using your body. The man wanted 10 million naira and my body. I had to do it. I had to do it for my husband. Oh my God. So you're trying to tell me that the guy you and your husband thought was dead is actually not dead. And his friends with Rose and Okoyo even Okoyo gone missing after sending the recording to Inspector Shola. Ha! This seems like a game plan. Mm -mm -mm -mm. It is a game plan. Bethany, I don't, I don't know what to do. My head is bursting. I am confused. Okay. Um, I got you. I got you, girl. Okay? Now listen. First of all, you have to keep everything you know to yourself. You mean I shouldn't talk to my husband about it? Don't talk to your husband about anything. We can handle this now. We have all the contacts we need to handle this ourselves. Or have you forgotten the daughter of whom you are? Exactly. Now we need to find out everything about those four. And we need to act fast. Very fast too. Hello, Mr. Shola. You want to see me? Okay then, tomorrow. He wants to see you again? Yes. What is going on? What is going on? What is going on? What is going on? He wants to see you for what? Babe, let me take care of this guy. I already got blood stains in my hands. 
Let me just add him to the number, that's all. Hey, the father of my child will not be a serial killer. Just allow him do what he wants to do till he gets tired and changes his mind. Allow him do whatever he wants. You think it's that easy? Did you hear yourself? You think I'm happy allowing another man to plow you? What is going on here? Wait, is it that you're enjoying this right now? Because... <sighs> Will it suffice to call you? I see. No wonder you called it a message. Hello, Zinni. Prepare everyone. Tomorrow, we ride. Dolly, you're still in your clothes. There is no time for frivolities, okay? Pill it off. Let's get down to business. I tell you, today I want it really hard. You know, preferably from behind. <laughs> oh. You'll never have me again. Did you just say that? You heard me. <laughs> oh. Well, to be candid, I do not intend to. Because I have had my feel. Okay? Consider this the last time. As a matter of fact, consider it a sent forth for daddy. Now, take it. Have a drink. And um, cheers to your loss. My loss? Yes. Your loss. You will definitely miss me. You know, your husband is a very greedy man. He wants you all to himself. He doesn't want to share anymore. Well, he can have you, all I care. I told him to give me an additional 20 million naira, and he agreed. So, cheers. Let me get that. Hello? Hello? Yes. She will be stone dead in minutes. I gave it to her and she took it. There will be no need for a plan B. Hey. <laughs> Sleeping beauty. She must be in dreamland. Hey, wake up. Welcome back online, honey. <laughs> Me? <laughs> no, 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 no. My men took care of it. Hey! 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 I don't need noise. I don't like noise. You can scream all you want, but nobody's gonna hear you. Okay? This is Dennis's father's old abandoned property. So don't waste your breath, darling. You're pregnant. Can't you see? You have a bun in the oven, honey. Are you ready to tell me the truth? There's nothing to tell. <laughs> ah, you must think I'm Denisa. Do I look like Denisa? Do I? <laughs> Denisa is a nice one. I'm not. I'm a biatch. The biggest biatch. Okay? And I can do anything that I want. 
<laughs> ah. You see this? This is Pepe Atarodo. Do you know what that is? I'm going to pour this on you and use this knife to dissect every inch of your skin. Chop, chop, chop! Start talking. <laughs> Start talking! Hurry up, talk! The baby in your belly. Is it for my friend Anissa? Yes, yes. yes. Tell me the truth! No, 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 no. You think I'm joking? No, no. My child. <laughs> and the father? Who is the father of this baby? My boyfriend. Your boyfriend, Oliver? <laughs> now you're going to tell me everything you know because the police are already on their way to capture Shola, Unkoyo, Oliver, Nelson. Yes, we already know Nelson isn't dead. And the only reason I'm even bothering to do all of this interrogation is because I absolutely need to as a backup plan. Okay? So talk now! I'm going to slit your throat and dump it in the river! Talk! I'll talk! Hurry up! What are you waiting for? <sighs> Hurry up! The plan was for Oliver to get married to Denisa and then inherit the 30 million dollars her father left for her in the ISA account. That was the plan. Of course. Of course. Because Denisa would have honorably changed the beneficiary name to Oliver's. Huh. Ah. Well scripted. This must be a blockbuster. <laughs> so, you're trying to tell me that Oliver just took Danisa out on a staycation just so he can refurnish the house and bring in that new maid, Unkoyo, so she can record the incident of Nelson playing dead. So, Shola, that's Inspector, will step in and exploit my friend Danisa. Mm, 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 mm. And if that didn't work, he was going to file for a divorce on the grounds of infidelity and claim half of our wealth. Ah! Oh, God. Oh, that Oliver. Oliver had the audacity, the infantry, to deceive my friend not to carry her own child so he doesn't disfigure her body, bringing up lies about his mom dying of childbirth so that you can then step in as a surrogate mother so the child in your belly was made with your egg and not hers oh, God. <laughs> oh my goodness you're crying also you are crying you are wicked you are very wicked how can you do this to a fellow woman like you you don't deserve this child in your belly. You don't. You and your goons are going to rot in jail. You are going to be buried in jail. Why her and her entire family will rot in hell? What? Yes, surprise. It was all just a revenge skin. <laughs> We were all four kids living in the same area. We were poor. We were trying parents. All we had was tattered clothes, tattered school uniforms, tattered bags. 
we all had high hopes for the future. Denise's dad back then was a minister for the FCT. When he bootlessly demolished our buildings, our businesses, our home. And in that process, Nelson and his sister and Koyu lost their parents. Can you imagine that? We had nowhere to turn to. No home to go back to. All we had was ourselves. The street raised us. And I for an eye. A tooth for a tooth. It doesn't kill. You can do whatever you want. Because your friend, Denisa, by now, should be dead. Yes, dead. Today's our last day on earth. There's nothing you or anybody can do. Rich. Stickingly rich. rich. Well done. Good job. Good job. Congratulations. Good job. And let me, let me double check. And there's no need for that. She's gone. And how do we get rid of this? That shouldn't be a problem. Exactly. <laughs> I would have loved to have her one more time. Well, you can go ahead. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with me? It was purely business. Then you got emotional. That's wrong. You are up to something? Get down on your knees now. Oliver, what the hell is this? Get down on your fucking knees. A little more wouldn't have spoiled anything. That was not a problem. You want to stab me in the back? No, I'm going to stab you right in your fucking face. Get down on your knees, Bruce. Motherfucker. <laughs> 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 I know what you're looking for. Fortunately, Nelson took care of me. Nelson? His loyalty lies with me. Nelson, you're pointing a gun at me too? Oliver, stop this, okay? I don't deserve to die. You must die. See, it's it's purely business. It's nothing personal, bro. What have I done wrong? We've been doing business all along. It's business. Don't be sentimental. You my guy, stop this. Don't come closer! Come! Oh. Oh. Could you bastard? You wanted half of the money, yet you wanted to sleep with a girl forever. You deserve to die. Um, so now that we've taken him out of the way... It's the police! Who's this here? That's coming. Hey, hey, hey. Come down. No. He's Come down and listen to me! Hey, hey, the police! Okay, okay. I have a good story. Okay, 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 okay. You poisoned my wife. Okay. You tried to kill me. I acted out of self-defense. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's a very good story, but I'm not supposed to be here. I didn't hear it. Okay. <sighs> go put it back. Hey, come, come, come. Okay. Careful. Yeah. Careful. Get the safe room. It's okay. okay. I acted out of self defense. You are a liar! You are a liar! Oh, what do you mean I'm lying? Him. What do you mean I'm lying? I'm asking where my friend is! Your friend is in the room! Go inside the room! You poison! Go inside the room! 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 Go inside the
to do this. I swear to God, I will make sure you pay for this. Watch me. Watch you. Did you say watch you? Your dad had it coming. Now let me take you on a memory journey. For the lives your dad wrecked by demolishing houses, buildings, churches, schools, recreational centers, hospitals, all in the name of building a better community. And what happened? He never considered those who owned the land. He left many destitute, many died. And what? He went on to live happily ever after. He was doing his job. Oh, he was doing his job. He was doing his job. My mom, she was sick. There was no money. I had to hug, beg, just to get drugs for my mom. The one thing that mattered to my mom was her house, her land. What happened? She died because of your dad's action. You tell me he was doing his job? That's got nothing to do with me. Nothing to do with me. That was my father. My mom was the precious thing. That meant the world to me. You said it was your father. Are you not his blood? Are you not? Didn't you enjoy out of the goodies? Didn't you? Was the destitutes and the other people suffered? Some died. Some are still suffering. Did you ever love me? What rubbish now? What rubbish are you talking about? Officers are arresting. What rubbish are you talking about? Officer, take him away! Take him away! You're so smart! You're This is not the end of the story, but a story yet to begin. I gave you my love, I gave you my all, but you played me for a fool. You promised forever it was not. from such hurt, such deceit, such evil. It's not like my father was a saint. Is this what they call the politician's cause? But you're not your father. You can't be blamed for his crimes and mistakes. See, this is what we're going to do. You're going to get up, freshen up, and dress to the tea. Because we are going out tonight, okay? Stand up, stand up, stand up, let's go, let's go. Uh-uh. 
You're still wearing your ring. Please remove this thing. Oh, I still love remove, it. You'll be all right, last last. Come on, let's go. And oh I'm picking God. your outfits. Guess what you're wearing? Katua, honey. I knew that was let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Hey!